Hi, this is just a quick tutorial on toolbars. I get asked uh, quite often uh, where it's gone, how they disappeared, how to get them back, or how to make them disappear and get rid of them. Uh, it's quite simple. Here I'm using Internet Explorer and it works almost exactly the same as uh, Firefox. They both work very similar. Google Chrome's a little different, um, and I'll do a tutorial and show you how to use that. But so I've, I've been to people's places and they've got toolbars halfway down the page, and you know they just slow you down and they make your viewing area so much smaller and you can have them on and turn them off and on to when you need them and it's quite simple if you click up the top up here this is Internet Explorer if you're not sure what you're using it's quite simple if you click up here somewhere and just put a tick in the menu bar this line of uh, options will pop up to the tools and the help if you click on help scroll down to about and you can see it's Internet Explorer and it'll even tell you if you click on it'll even tell you what version so and the same thing with Firefox same thing, your right mouse button, make sure your menu bar is turned on, click on the help, about Firefox, and there you go. So to turn these bars off is quite a simple uh, task. Right mouse button, take the tick out of the bars, and there we go, they're turned off. Want to put them back again? It's quite simple. Works exactly the same as in Internet Explorer. Some bars have a enable and disable function like this is an Adobe PDF bar if I want to turn that off I have to disable it you know if you're the sort of person who goes to crack sites or hack sites or those other sorts of sites we don't mention and are at a high risk of getting viruses or spyware on your machine because of the sites you attend um, I would recommend you don't disable your antivirus bars I'd leave them on if you've got toolbars on there and you don't know what these are, fair chances you never use them anyway, so normally it doesn't hurt to disable them. But as I mentioned, just leave the uh, the spyware ones and the, and the antivirus bars active. So yeah, thanks for watching, that's, uh, that's how simple it is.